Dan Turn here at the Spectaculab. Today is my first day, um, but don't worry, you know what I'm doing. <laughs> um, wow, you're you're all here. <laughs> you're all here. Uh, why are you all here? Oh, uh, oh, right. Yes, of course. The ribbon, of course. We are here to cut the ribbon to officially open the Spectaculab. This is exciting. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Um, we have some very special guests here with us today. Each of them have played a key role in creating this exciting new show. And uh, so I'm going to please welcome to our stage or uh, platform or stage, whatever you prefer. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh, anyways, uh, I am very excited to introduce our first very special guest. She is the founder and executive director of Science from Scientists. How cool is that, right? And not only does she have a PhD in biochemistry from Boston University School of Medicine, she is also part of the advisory council for the dean of the School of Engineering at MIT. <laughs> and she was also Miss Massachusetts in 2004. Pretty crazy, right? That's so cool. She is also the host of the Dr. Erica Show, an educational science show for children that I personally love. <laughs> Even though I'm not a child. <laughs> well, not the age of a child. <laughs> Anyways, uh, please help me welcome to the stage Dr. Erica Ebel Engel. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Nelson Mandela once said, education is the great engine of personal development. It is through education that a daughter of a peasant can become a doctor, that the son of a mine worker can become the head of the mine, that a child of farm workers can become the president of a great nation. It is what we make out of what we have, not what we are given, that separates one person from another. When I founded Science from Scientists 15 years ago, it was my vision that we would help elementary and middle school age children to better understand and appreciate the importance and wonder of STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math, by improving their knowledge and appreciation of these subjects. Through their increased comprehension, confidence, and understanding, children touched by Science from Scientists would become better thinkers, better contributors, and as a result, better citizens in childhood and adulthood. They would improve our world through the invention of semiconductors for technology, through discovering new treatments for life-threatening diseases, through building rockets to reach distant galaxies barely visible to the naked eye. I believe we are all here today, Murata, Science from Scientists, and Disney, because we believe in the power of education. We want to teach our children how to think, we want to instill in them the confidence to tackle problems and to overcome them. We want to open their eyes to the marvel and wonder of science, its significance in our lives and in the world around us. I cannot emphasize how excited, honored, and truthfully still disbelieving I am that this is happening. I believe that the Spectacular gives us the opportunity to fascinate and inspire children who might not have had an opportunity to see how amazing science and engineering can be. In working with Murata, a wonderful partner with a rich history of invention, innovation, and perseverance, we find a kindred spirit. You are a company who makes a tangible difference in the world. In working with Disney, the door opens to the world of imagination, awe-inspiring wonder, storytelling, and magic. We work together to make Spectacular bring to life the excitement of STEM. We will reach tens of thousands of children and their families, and we will do it by combining the magic of entertainment, the thrill of hands-on experiential learning, and the fascinating reality that is the physics of our world. The Spectacular will indeed be an experience that will inspire the next generation and beyond. Thank you, everyone, for making this possible. I'm extremely excited to add the first ingredient to our beaker. Wow! How cool is that? That is awesome! Alright! Give it up for Erica one more time, you guys! Fantastic! And now, here to add another ingredient uh, 
ingredient to our experiment and address all of us is the president and CEO of Murata Electronics America, innovators in electronics. Please welcome David Kirk. <laughs> Though Murata is well known in the global electronics industry, we may be unfamiliar with many of you. However, most likely you've encountered many of our products already this morning. If you used a smartphone, a tablet, a laptop, when you drove here in your car or truck. If you glanced up at a smartwatch or checked out the weather on a flat screen TV, it is nearly certain that you benefited from several of Murata's various technologies. As one of the world's largest electronic companies, our roots go back to the 1930s when Akira Murata was an extremely sick child in Japan. He was so ill he could not attend school regularly. He stayed home, read ferociously, to learn about the world around him. He was passionately, particularly passionate about one subject, science. As Akira's health improved, he began working at the family's ceramic pottery business in Kyoto. When his father became ill, he stepped up to lead the company. There were ups and downs, trials and errors. Some of his co-workers even said that he was trying to take the on the impossible when he challenged with developing new materials and technologies. Akira's desire to improve the struggling company drove him to learn about specialized ceramics. This led him to his mentor, Tetsuro Tanaka, an associate professor of electrical engineering at Kyoto University. Professor Tanaka introduced Akira to a new material they both believed would change the world, barium titanate, which would eventually be dubbed World Wonderstones because of the vast electrical properties. These Wonderstones would definitely determine the direction of Murata's future and ultimately help shape much of today's electronics devices. With the heart and mindset of a scientist, Akira expanded to make the company's business using his imagination to design products that no one else was even thinking about. As Murata Manufacturing grew, he developed a philosophy, or as it's referred to in Japanese culture, Shazé, which calls upon every employee to use science to create innovative products that would contribute to the advancement of society. This philosophy remains constant for all of these years and it's the reason why we are here today. When deciding to collaborate with Disney and science from scientists to create the spectacular lab, we saw this as an opportunity to put our philosophy to work. To inspire young people to expand their interest in science and technology to begin their path towards finding the next Wonderstone. Thinking about the hopes and dreams of that young boy in Japan so many years ago, I'm thrilled to stand in front of you today seeing the imagination, science, and innovation is alive and well. This would have made Akira Murata very proud. With that, I will actually add the second ingredient. Incredible, thank you so much. Let's give it up for David one more time, you guys. Now, for our third element in our beaker, please join me in welcoming Vice President Epcot, Melissa Veliquet. <laughs> I'm so glad that you've joined us today for this special opening. It's always a special day when we get to debut new offerings in our park. Today, I'm thrilled to announce the opening of the Spectaculab, presented by Murata. I want to thank our friends at Murata and Science from Scientists for helping us bring to life something that is both educational, inspirational, and most importantly, fun. The Spectaculab is another element of the rich legacy of storytelling, innovation, and imagination here at Epcot. 
You know, every day I speak to guests in our park who tell me that they visited Epcot as a child, and it was that visit that gave them the spark of inspiration to choose a path for the future. It gives me great pleasure to debut something today that we know in just a short few moments there will be children who will visit the Spectacular and it might change their future. That's very inspiring and that's what Epcot is all about. In fact, it's even more exciting to think that these young scientists might be those who create the innovations and inventions of our future. We hope the Spectacular will inspire guests of all ages to continue to pursue advances in science, technology, engineering, and in math. And now, the third element in our beaker. <laughs> awesome. But Frankie, looks like we still need one more. Yes, of course, right you are, Melissa. And to add that final ingredient to our experiment is the one and only Mickey Mouse. Oh yeah, wait one second though, Mickey. I think this is the perfect moment for a photo, right? Awesome, Melissa, hang out right here for me. Erica, David, scoot on in for me. And Mickey, you can hang out right there. Perfect. All right, here we go. Say cheese, everyone. And now say science. Science. <laughs> wow, this is so exciting. Thank you so much, Mickey. Now is the perfect moment to add that final ingredient. Here we go, folks. Thank you. 